Hey, Claude Johnson here with GuitarControl.com and uh, I'm going to do another little mini lesson on guitar soloing skills. So I think, you know, when it comes to soloing, probably the most important thing is being able to play melodies, right? Because that's really what lead guitar is, is, is playing melodies, playing the melodic lines that will fit over a chord progression, you know, it's kind of a, an accompaniment to the song. So, I think the easiest way to do this is first of all, you gotta start with the pentatonic scale. So, you know, pick a key, let's take A, and just start with some simple licks, you know. Um, there you go, here's a lick. This is just an example. And I'm starting on the root, and I'm also ending on the root. So I go seventh fret D string, and I go up to the G string, five fret, seventh fret, and then B string, fifth fret, and then back down. So real slow. So notice that I'm ending it with some vibrato. And um, that's another important thing. Probably the second most important thing besides melodies is the phrasing that includes vibrato. So you want to do that and your licks on each degree of the scale. Here's another lick for you. Um, Starting here on the eighth fret, B string. Let's do this, and then bend. And then bend, release, and pull off. Back down to the root, then in there. simpler than that. You can do something as simple as um, it's three notes or even two notes. Or the key is make a melody. And you can sing it too, you know. Try to make it melodic melodies. Okay, so stay in the pentatonic scale. Try to do licks ending on each of the notes. That's the lesson for for today. And again, you can add the vibrato at the end to emphasize. So, uh, real short mini lesson. I'll give you more stuff soon. And uh, if you want to check out lead, uh, my lead guitar course for beginners, just go to guitarcontrol.com slash lead. Thanks for watching.